Just in the last few days, more than half a dozen people have been shot here in Metro Atlanta, some of them fatally. A new survey out this week takes a look at gun violence and its impacts. A new at 5, Fox 5's Tyler Finger is here in studio with a look at what was found. Tyler. Well, yeah, Courtney, Tom, we see shootings and murders often in our area, but in Metro Atlanta isn't the only place dealing with that problem. According to a new survey, a majority of adults have either personally or had a family member impacted by gun violence. And if you haven't been impacted, you may not understand the effect gun violence really has. Aaliyah Strong knows firsthand the difficulty of losing a loved one to a bullet. You would just never imagine that you go to work to try to provide for your family and just really make an honest living and you wouldn't make it home. Her fiance, Ty Ross, was working as a security guard at a downtown Atlanta hookah bar when he was shot and killed last year. Strong has turned her pain into action. She launched Time to Thrive, an Atlanta area nonprofit that aims to help put an end to gun violence and help those already impacted by it. If I can save one person a day, like I've done my job, you know, it is my hope to inspire change across the world. Gun violence isn't just a problem in our area, but across the country. According to a new survey from the Kaiser Family Foundation, roughly one in five adults has had a family member killed by a gun, including suicide. The survey found that people of color are disproportionately impacted. Numbers like those push strong to do more in the name of her fiance. The numbers are an alarming rate right now and so I feel like it's my job to kind of step in and be the voice right now. After a tragic loss, her mission now is to use her grief for good and work to end gun violence. Oh, it's really heartbreaking, honestly, that this is something that we're having to deal with. Another interesting stat from that survey, 84% of adults say they have taken precautions to protect themselves or their families from gun violence. If you want to take a deeper dive into the numbers, we'll put the link for it in this story on fox5atlanta.com. Yeah, those I'm statistics, Courtney. so surprising and, and so scary. Mm -hmm. It's unfortunate we even have to do so, uh, that there, this even is a problem right yeah, now. Yeah, sure is. All right, Tyler, thanks. Thanks, Tyler.